Roger Federer may have retired from the tennis court in 2022, but that being said, he has some luxurious options to choose from when it comes to where he's spending his retirement years. In 2014, Roger and his wife, Mirka Federer, bought a $7.3 million home in Wallerau, Switzerland. The property boasts large glass windows that offer residents stunning views of Lake Zurich from the home's balcony. Situated on a 1.5-acre plot, the three-story residence is divided into two apartments. Embracing the minimalist design, the home features a spacious master bedroom with a modern, elegant bathroom. Additionally, the expansive living room provides plenty of space for the Federer family to unwind. Roger Federer, the Swiss tennis legend, is not only celebrated for his exceptional wins on the court, but also admired for his love story with his wife, Mirka Federer. Roger met Mirka, also a professional tennis player at the time, during the 2000 Sydney Olympics. Sparks flew and their connection quickly blossomed into a deep and lasting relationship. The couple's love for tennis was a significant bond that brought them together, but... It was their mutual understanding and support for one another's careers that truly solidified their partnership. Mirka, who had to retire early from pro tennis due to a foot injury, seamlessly transitioned into a supportive role, managing Roger's career and accompanying him on his journey to becoming one of the greatest tennis players of all time. In 2009, after nearly a decade together, Roger and Mirka tied the knot in a private ceremony in Basel, Switzerland, surrounded by close family and friends. Their marriage marked the beginning of a new chapter, and the couple soon started their family. They welcomed their first set of twins, daughters Myla and Charlene, later that same year. In 2014, the Federer family expanded further with the birth of another set of twins, this time boys Leo and Lenny. The Federer family is known for leading a relatively private life away from the public eye, valuing their time together at their home in Switzerland despite the global fame and success. Over the years, Roger Federer has owned several glamorous homes. One of his first properties was an apartment in Bach, Switzerland, located on the southern shore of Lake Zurich. Details about this lakeside unit, such as its price or square footage, remain largely unknown. Roger reportedly sold the apartment in February 2014. In 2008, Roger purchased a property in the Swiss village of Valbella, within the ski area, which is a popular holiday destination. It was reported that Roger demolished the original structure and built his own modern mountain retreat. The Swiss style chalet features open spaces, custom woodwork and paneling, creating a cozy cabin atmosphere. The property also includes a tennis court, though Roger might be more focused on other activities these days. In 2021, Roger said, One of my goals when I retire is I'll have time to explore mountain bike trails. Mountain biking has become really big in Switzerland because we want to make the mountain regions year-round destinations. Roger and Mirka still own this property along with a neighboring chalet used by his parents, connected to the main house via an underground passage. The Federers reportedly spent about $30 million on vacant 5,800 square meter parcel of land too on a scenic slope overlooking Lake Zurich in Herleberg, Switzerland. Although there was speculation he might build an ultra-modern mansion on this prime real estate, the lot remains undeveloped and it's believed Federer still owns it. Aside from his main home, which we'll look at in a moment, in 2014, Roger purchased a penthouse in Dubai's exclusive La Rev skyscraper for reported $23.5 million. This luxury unit includes five bedrooms, each with an ensuite bath, with the primary bedroom featuring a spacious dressing room and walk-in closet. This penthouse boasts marble floors, copper ceilings, and stunning marina views with multi-million dollar yachts in sight. The tower's amenities even allow Federer to request a helicopter or private jet at the press of a button. Federer once said, I remember it was brutally hot, like 39 Celsius every day, but I had a good time practicing. It was peaceful and quiet and I kind of enjoyed it here in Dubai. The next thing I knew, I had an apartment. Roger's latest home is still under construction, but if his other properties are any indication, it'll be as grand as the rest of them. 2018, he purchased a large lot in Switzerland located at the northern end of Lake Zurich. So plans for this residence here reportedly include a classroom, an indoor sports area, and naturally a tennis court. Now for the main home. 
In 2014, Federer and his family moved into their main residence in Wallerau, Switzerland after purchasing the property for $7.3 million. His home-based mansion is close to his former Bach apartment and was custom-built, offering three stories as well as floor-to-ceiling windows with breathtaking views of the lake. The interior includes a massive stone fireplace which spans all three floors, expansive wood plank decks, a swimming pool, a spa, a state-of-the-art gym, there's also an underground garage where Roger likely keeps his prized Mercedes-Benz collection. In a 2012 interview, Roger described his dream home as very modern and cozy. Does that exist? Well, he also mentioned his admiration for the architecture firm Herzog & de Muron based in his hometown of Basel. But it's unclear if they were involved in the design of this Walrau home. The mansion, set on 1.5 acres, is divided into two separate apartments and was designed with a minimalist aesthetic. The couple's home features a spacious master bedroom with a sleek bathroom and large living room perfect for family gatherings. Roger Federer's impressive portfolio of properties is a reflection of his success, taste, and love for both luxury and privacy. From his modern home in Waller of Switzerland to the chic penthouse in Dubai's Le Rev Tower, the tennis star has carefully selected residents that offer not only comfort and elegance, but also breathtaking views and serene environments. Each of these properties, whether nestled in the Swiss mountains or overlooking Lake Zurich, have been chosen with his family's needs and their lifestyle in mind. That'll wrap up today's video. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you in another one. Bye.